Cyber pirates or cyber squatters are people who register valuable trademarks as domain names with the goal of making a profit, typically by selling the domain names back to the trademark owners. The Ninth Circuit considered whether a so called cyber pirate was guilty of unlawful trademark dilution in the 1998 case, Panavision International v. Teppan. Panavision International, a California movie and television camera company, owned the trademarks Panavision and Panaflex. In 1995, Panavision tried to register the domain name Panavision.com with Network Solutions, only to learn that an individual, Dennis Teppan, had already registered the name for a website featuring aerial views of Pana, Illinois. When Panavision sent the Illinois resident a letter explaining that Panavision was a trademark and demanding that he stop using Panavision.com, Teppan offered to surrender the domain name for $13,000. Panavision refused. So Teppan registered the domain name Panaflex.com for a website containing a single word, hello. Panavision sued Teppan in one of California's federal district courts calling Teppan a cyber pirate and accusing him of violating the Federal Trademark Dilution Act, or FTDA. After concluding that it had personal jurisdiction over Teppan, the district court entered summary judgment for Panavision on the trademark dilution issue. Teppan appealed to the Ninth Circuit, claiming in relevant part that he didn't violate the FTDA because he didn't use Panavision's trademarks commercially, nor did he dilute the trademarks. 